So here we are for commotion in the ocean. Yeah. Goodness me. There's a curious commotion at the bottom of the ocean. I think we ought to go and take a look. You'll find every sort of creature that lives beneath the sea swimming through the pages of this book. There are dolphins, whales and penguins. There are jellyfish and sharks. There's the turtle and the big white polar bear. But can you see behind the wrecks and in between the rocks? Let's see if we can find who's hiding there. And have a little look. I've spotted our starfish. There's one, two, three. See if you can spot them in each picture. Our first one is a crab. The crab likes walking sideways. And I think the reason why is to make himself look sneaky and pretend that he's a spy. Mm. And we've got turtles. We crawl up the beach from the water to bury our eggs on dry land. We lay a whole batch, and then when they hatch, they scamper about on the sand. Pitter patter, pitter patter. Let's look for our starfish. Have you spotted any? I can see one there, and one there, and I think the other one was hiding with the crabs. Did you see him? No, the page. There he is. Look right at the very top. There, hiding. Who's on the next page? <gasps> Dolphins! There we are, look at that. The wonderful thing about dolphins is hearing them trying to speak. But it's not, how do you do, like I'd say to you. It's more of a click, whistle, squeak. <gasps> can you see a starfish? I can see one right at the top, riding on. The dolphin, right there, look. There he is. And where are the others? Maybe they're in this side of the picture. Shout up when you see one. And anybody see one? Oh, there's one. There's one right there. And if you look very, very, very closely, I'll bring it a bit closer to you. Can you see one on the beach? There he is, right there in the middle. Ooh, that's a bit too close, Kate. <laughs> we found them. Now, who's next? <gasps> it's the angelfish. Hello, I'm an angelfish, darling. The prettiest thing in the sea. What a shame there are no other creatures as gorgeous and lovely as me. Mwah! Oh, doesn't she think she's something? I don't know. No, this one. This one used to be my Joshua's favourite. It's the jellyfish. The jellyfish just loves to jiggle, which other fish think is quite dumb. She knows it's not all that useful, but jiggling the very good fun. <laughs> can we spot our starfish? I can see one there. I think we might need to go back to the angelfish to find the others. There's one. And a little bit further... There's the other one, look. Oh, you're good at spotting these. You shout out when you see them. <gasps> oh my goodness, look at the teeth on that. And it goes so big, it's so big, it's so big. <gasps> He's a shark. I swim with a grin up to greet you. See how my jaws open wide. Why don't you come a bit closer? Please, Take a good look inside. Ah! They're running away. Or swimming away. There they are, all three of them. Quick! Swim, swim, swim. I'd swim away as well. And now we've got a swordfish. Can you see him? He's right up at the top. There's his tail. And there's his long pointy nose like a sword. Meow! All the way. I love to chase after small fishes. It stops me from getting too bored. And then when I start feeling hungry, I skewer a few on my sword. <gasps> Can you see a starfish? There he is. Now let's have the octopus. Look, it's got all these babies. Octopus. 
There she is. Having eight arms can be useful. You may think it looks a bit funny, but it helps me to hold all my children and tickle each one on the tummy. Tickle, 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 tickle. Oh, very nice. Oh, have we spotted any more star? Oh, I can see the starfish. There they are. Look. One. And that one's having a tickle on the tummy. How lovely. Oh, now. Oh, can you see them? These big flat things here called stingrays. At the bottom of the ocean, the stingray flaps his wings. But don't you get too close to him. His tail really stings. Zzz, zzz, zaps you with electricity. Not at all friendly. Oh, let's go over here and see. What have we got? Oh, we've got some lobsters here. Never shake hands with a lobster. It isn't a wise thing to do. With a clippity clap and a snippity snap, he would snip all your fingers in two. Snip, snap. Oh no, don't like the sound of that. There's a starfish. Where are the other ones? Oh, there's one there, look. Climbing out. Oh, I've spotted the other one. Can you see him? He's all the way over here. There he is. Oh, good. Oh my goodness me. Look at all these strange looking fish. And there's another blobby one down there as well. Look at him. Let's see if you can spot the starfish while I read. Miles below the surface where the water's dark and deep live the most amazing creatures that you could ever meet. There are fish of all descriptions, of every shape and size. Some have giant pointy teeth and great big bulbous eyes. Some of them can walk around and balance on their fins. But the strangest fish of all have glowing whiskers on their chins. <gasps> they do. There's one with a glowing whisker on his chin, look. Ooh. And I've spotted our starfish. One, two... Three. Goodness me. Oh, ah, look at only the tail. Ooh, whoosh. He's the giant blue whale. There he is, look. Goodness gracious me. And there's some little tiny fishes and some starfish. There's no other beast on the planet as big as the giant blue whale. He measures one massive 100 feet long from his head to the tip of his tail. Whoosh! Outspurts the water. But look what's on his tummy. Can you see them? They're tiny little things. Even the, the words are small. Can you see them? They're called barnacles. We're just a bunch of barnacles and all we do is cling. We know it's not that glamorous. But it's our favourite thing. Oh, well, they seem happy enough, don't they? Oh, did we spot all the starfish? There's one there. Oop, focus camera. And the other two. We're down there, look. One, two. Hiding at the bottom of there. <gasps> Walruses. Our bodies are covered with blubber. Our tusks are incredibly long. We're grumpy and proud and we bellow out loud to show that we're mighty and strong. Urgh, he says, goodness me. And can you see a little starfish just at the bottom there? Oh, and where's the other? Oh, goodness, what a lot of walruses. Oh, is there another starfish? There he is, look, right by my thumb. And there's one more peeking over the top, just there. Oh, and here we found the penguins. Look, I told you they'd be there. We waddle about on our icebergs, which makes our feet slither and slide. And when we get close to the water, we leap with a splosh off the side. Splish splosh. And there they go. Splat. And then we've got the polar bears. Deep out in the Arctic, the mummy polar bear snuggles up with her all her children as it's very cold out there it certainly is now where on earth have my starfish gone let me see <gasps> there's one right up on the top here that you might not be able to spot just see a little dark hole right there there's one mm, the others are hiding oh there's another one i've spotted another one 
There he is, look right next to the penguin there. So where's the other one? Give me a shout out if you can see him. I think he's hidden. I think he's gone. Oh no, back again, Kate. There he is, look. He's cheating, he looks just like the penguin's feet. That's why I missed him. Now this is the last one, who can you spot? What a lot of creatures we have seen beneath the sea. What a lot of funny things they do. Some of them might lick their lips and eat you in one bite. Um, and some might want to swim around with you. The dolphin's very friendly and the lobster's very fierce. But the shark is the most dangerous by far. Can you name the other friends we've made along the way? See if you can tell me who they are. Can you tell me who everybody is? We've got a lobster, an octopus, a shark, a blue whale, just about as it lies, got a dolphin, some angel fish, a jellyfish, and a swordfish. And down here at the very last bit are our three starfish. Safe and sound. One, two, three. Well, I hope you enjoyed that one. And I'll see you again soon for another story.